What made this script so expensive? Um, I think there was a bidding war. The script came on the table, and everybody wanted to do it. <laughs> that's Sharon Stone. <laughs> you might not recognize her, but that was her. Oh, I think she's evil, and I think she's divine. I think what Paul has brought to Basic Instinct was a, a morality play. And I think, uh, as he's probably spoken, I think that he saw in the character of Catherine evil, evil personified. Uh, and evil, the devil, uh, the real devil, comes in the most seductive kinds of, of forms. Paul, you've been interested in sex from the very start of your career. Your early Dutch films uh, have a very heavy sexual content. Well, I grew up, of course, uh, when I started my filmmaking career, which was in the 70s, there was this whole movement of open sexuality, uh, especially in the country where I was living, which was Holland. You had this um, freedom, exploration, you know? I mean, um, sleeping with a woman, sleeping with another woman and another woman was kind of normal. And you had to explore that. Even when you were married, you should have an affair. Personally, I enjoy sex, and I think sex is a really um, strong thing in life, and <clears throat> it should be enjoyed, and it should not be sinful, and sex for, for only for pleasure is okay, and I've always tried to portray that in the movies. Uh, Michael, what attracted you to this particular role? The sexuality. Uh, truthfully, I've been trying over a period of time to uh, broaden my horizons as an actor. I think one of the responsibilities as an actor you have is to try to reach out. And so I try to play different types of, of roles. And I, in thinking about different things, um, I thought, well, I haven't really done any sexually explicit type parts um, ever. Was there any stage uh, during the film when you, when you said, enough, I won't go further than that? You, you got to go for it. Yeah, as far as that scene with Gene, I took a more aggressive, uh, uh, not only in the scene, but as the actor, the more experienced actor. And she's such a good reactor uh, that I said, look, I'll take the lead. But again, you choreograph it. And she's very funny when she talks about it. I say, OK, up against the wall, kiss, kiss, boom, rip the shirt, kiss, kiss, leg up, kiss, boom, we go to the other wall. And it's a dance. It's choreographed. There was a bit of improvisation, but I really knew, for the most part, what was going to be happening next. And that took a lot of the fear out of it. You know, the fear, usually fear, is of the un unknown. You keep that too close to the flame. <laughs> most of us in our lives have not had big fights or have killed somebody. But so you see that in a movie. Sex scenes, we all can understand. Everybody's a judge. So it's a more difficult thing to pull off. There's been so much attention about, oh, the nudity or the, the powerful quality of this. I mean, every, you accept and reveal very vulnerable things with every character that you play. I mean, it's, it's kind of the joy of it. 